So we bought this um, Toby the robot for Edward's fifth birthday and uh, we thought we'd do a quick review to put it together. Uh, it does say eight years old on it, um, but Edward's actually only five, so I will help him and we'll see what we think of it. Okay, opening the box, obviously the manual. I uh, can see a couple of little motors in there and just a load of plastic bits. Um, seems to be a lot of parts. Uh, but it looks pretty straightforward, so let's put it together. Oh, it's easily labelled, got an A and a B section. And I assume that's a C section, yay! And some other parts, so uh, just going to run through the instructions and see how we go. Okay, just uh, slots together, it's a really nice bit of movement there. So, uh, yeah, looking forward to seeing what this thing does. Okay, uh, instructions being really easy to follow, um, and it's quite well made, although it's plastic, uh, it fits together quite nicely. Okay, the other side of the uh, unit, um, some intricate cog uh, set up there, but um, all quite easy, just slips in. Okay, guys, so starting to take shape, got a little face there. Um, Nice little circuit board in the back. All still quite straightforward following the instructions. Um, what do you think, Ed? Good. Getting together. Daddy, so, why is it so small when you did loads of hard work? Yeah, I don't know why I've put so much hard work into something so small. Maybe it'll be good at the end. It's really diffusing. Is it? Yeah. Let's see. Hey guys, I'm about an hour in now. Um, got his head together I did have a little bit of a technical issue in the fact that uh, the batteries are inside the head and I press the button it wouldn't actually switch on so I, I took it to bits uh, which was more trouble than I thought um, but it does work uh, so a bit of advice would be to actually test it fully before you uh, put it all together um, but I believe it's working so now I'm just on the, the bottom bit and like I said, I've been going about an hour now, so uh, nice and steady, no rush. Okay, so here it is, little Toby. So I believe uh, it says to long press two seconds. So he works. <laughs> yeah. Toby's gone nuts. We're not quite sure what Toby does. Toby just runs around and falls off his tables. What? So he's a bit like a crab. He's a spider. Oh look. Hello Toby. I don't, I don't think Toby likes you. <laughs> yeah, he does. He's looking around. Daddy. No, I, Thanks, Ed. I think he was just deliberately not looking at you. Oh, maybe he is now. Oh, he's very clever. Oh, my God. He's doing some sort of dance. Oh look, he knows. Stick your fingers in his face and he knows what to do. <laughs> I think you're the... Wait, what happens if he just... Let me put it there. Confuses him. How do we stop him? <laughs> That's how you stop him, eh? Pick him up. That's it. Put him back and down. And his legs... And then you just press. What's happening? I don't know, so let me see. So I think. Whoa. Calm down, Toby. No. He's working things out. Yeah, just put your, oh, so he is on avoid mode. And there you go. So there we go, guys. Took me about one and a half hours to build him. And he has follow me mode or avoid mode. 
follow me mode or explore mode I think so basically he'll go on his own or you can get him to follow you our little robot friend Ed expected him to speak but he doesn't he just peeps but uh, he's a good little fun robot a little bit basic if you want something a bit more speaking and he's ignoring us now he doesn't but, um, like us. Yeah, following the explore. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye. 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 Say bye, Ed. Bye.